Hi, teacher. Hey, hello. How are you? How are you? Nice. Just Good. ready in the previous day to finish this module. Yes. <laughs> yes, teacher. Okay. I'm happy for that. And I hope that you too. Blanca, why are you so serious? Por qué está tan seria? Good evening. No, no, nada. Nada que ver. Estaba viendo aquí el teléfono. Ah, ok. Estaba por estaba viendo. ¿Qué? Hello. Voy a apagar la cámara porque voy a cenar, oiga. No, sí, porque si no, no, va, no, no, va dar, no va a dar deseo de comer también. Es que yo salgo a las 7 de la noche de trabajar. Ah, ok. Excelente. Y yo salgo a las diez y media de la noche de trabajar. Sí, yo, de <ríe> yo de estudiar, teacher. Ah, ok. okay. Excelente. Do it. Bon appetit. Thank you. Ok. Enjoy your meal. Good evening. Hello, sir. Hi. Hello. Hello. Hi. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Yes, I do. Okay. Good evening. Hello, sir. Ya les confirmaba la tarde de este día. Oh, sure. What is Hello, hello, hello. 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 Are you still there? Okay. Not working at all. Oh. 
Okay, welcome back to all of you. We are so close to finish this module. Uh, I consider that all of you already got the email or in the English Corporativo. We're explaining uh, the way how you are going to fill out the form. Remember that we are going to do it together, but it's going to be on Monday. Recordarles que ya a estas alturas ya debió haberle llegado un correo, un mensaje con las instrucciones para el llenado de la encuesta, la cual deberemos de hacer en el día y en el momento preciso que se nos, va, se nos ha indicado. Nadie puede adelantarse a hacerla, ya que uh, hay una hora especial en la cual tendremos que realizarla. Por lo tanto, uh, solamente les pido que revisemos la información que se les ha enviado para que así no haya ninguna duda relacionada con algún dato que hay que copiar. Como les sugerí antes, Hello, baby, Blanquita, little Blanquita. Hola. Ah, está más contenta que las manos. Sí, anda feliz. Yeah. Very happy. It's very, very happy. Okay, uh, I, I was telling you that uh, you got all the information uh, in order to fill out the form. That is going to be the next Monday. We are going to start at 8.20. At that moment, I need that all of you be connected with good uh, internet service. And so please, if you can do it in a computer, it's going to be better because you need to copy and paste some information. And for the reason is, I consider that it's going to be better in a computer if you had the chance, the opportunity to do that in a computer. But if you don't have the chance to do it in that way, okay, you need to look for the better way how you are going to use your, your cell phones to do that. Como les estaba diciendo, uh, pues gracias a Dios ya estamos muy cerca de finalizar el módulo. Y generalmente después de varias largas jornadas, eh, es necesario, valga la redundancia, a hacer una evaluación de todo el proceso y es precisamente lo que haremos el día lunes. Iniciaremos a las 8 y 20, nadie puede iniciar antes ni tampoco a uh, hacer lo que a alguien se le ocurre hacerlo el día de mañana o el domingo. No, tenemos que hacerlo todos juntos. Esa es la instrucción que se nos ha dado. Por lo tanto, les pido de favor que respetemos las líneas ya dadas. Así como también se nos sugiere a... a a ustedes se les hizo mucho hincapié de que es importante en su momento pues tener la cámara encendida, eh, la asistencia es sumamente importante y bueno, cada quien sabe realmente cuántas veces o cuántas sesiones ha faltado, puede hacer el cálculo de eh, sacar el 80% para ver si realmente ha cumplido. Aclaro esto porque algunas veces después me escriben en privado cuando ya termina el módulo y me dicen, mire, que fíjese que quizás no me reportó, eh, que yo falté poco, que no sé qué. Y ustedes mismos son testigos que se les llama tres veces. Entonces, con una vez que, que en la primera vez no estaba, pero en la segunda sí. Entonces, al final, 
en el vídeo siempre queda registrado lo, eh, la cantidad de minutos que usted ha estado presente. Entonces, eso es lo que se toma en cuenta. Así es que solo, pues, decirle que cada quien revise su, su asistencia y de esa manera cada quien tiene su, su respuesta, ¿no? Si realmente ha cumplido o no ha cumplido el, el 80%. En mi caso, eh, pues, en eso a mí lo que me corresponde es solamente llamarlos las veces que el manual me lo indica y registrarle su asistencia. Por eso siempre eh, estoy muy seguro y lo llamo hasta dos, tres veces. Por si he tenido algún error, pues ahí lo corrijo. Y a veces también sucede que como en la primera vez ya los tengo registrados y a veces se me queda alguno. Y ustedes muy atentos me dicen, ah, no me faltó. Entonces yo estoy ahí siempre tratando de, de corregir cualquier error. ¿Verdad? Así es de que les invito a que revisen el, eh, la información, creo que hay un video corto, de cómo llenar la encuesta. Ya se lo mencioné anteriormente, tenemos que evitar eh, en todos los márgenes posibles los errores, porque no, no se podrá hacer este, ninguna corrección, ya al final se va a enviar tal como ustedes lo, lo llenen. La información... Eh, que les pidió el programa o que les envió después, ya cada quien tiene todos esos datos, el correo que usa, el número de referencia de cada uno. Entonces, es muy importante esa evaluación. Y ya luego en las preguntas relacionadas a, a contenido o a la forma de, de, de cómo hemos trabajado, pues ahí serán ustedes los que van a hacer la, la valoración pertinente. Ahí a nosotros no, no nos queda más que agradecerles por el, el espacio, el tiempo que hemos compartido juntos y que conste, yo me estoy despidiendo, me estoy explicando nada más eh, la forma de cómo llenar el, el, la encuesta. ¿no? Entonces ahí solamente está usted y su computador o su teléfono y será usted el que va a decidir la mejor opción que usted considere. ¿Verdad? Eso ya está en manos de usted. En lo que a mí respecta, pues como digo, eh, estoy siempre tratando de ayudarles en todo lo posible y de esa manera pues vamos a seguir adelante. Así es que no sé si tienen alguna consulta antes de que comencemos y si no hay, pues entonces quedaríamos a la expectativa luego ya de, de o pueden revisar eso eh, espacio y me pueden escribir al grupo para irles aclarando cualquier duda que se tenga y de esa forma pues hacemos todo lo más fácil posible ya para el día lunes a las 8 y 20 comenzamos todo les pido de favor de nuevo que estemos todos conectados a esa hora y bueno cumplamos la jornada que nos queda verdad ok espero que sí me hayan oído porque lo veo ahí sí. yes, teacher. como yes, calladito. Yes, teacher. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Welcome back. Welcome back. How was the Father's Day? Tell me. Ah, no me quieren contar cómo estuvo la celebración del Día del Padre. Ok, don't tell me then. Teacher, teacher. Excellent. Okay. Nos ha dejado callados. Ah, no, I don't know why. No, yo solo estoy explicando lo de, lo de la encuesta, que no quiero que haya... La celebración nos dejó callados. Ah, ok. Ellos vienen, ellos vienen tired. They, they are tired. Vienen cansados de la celebración. Ah, ok. Ajá. Agotados. <ríe> no, cansados. Mucho chumpe les dieron. <ríe> Sí, hay que verle la carita quien más se ría de ellos, veamos quién puede ser. No, ya se pusieron serios todos, ¿eh? Ahí están, very serious. Ah, ok, no nos cuenten entonces. Mucho chumpe, comieron. Oigan, oigan lo que les dice la compañera. No se van teacher. a defender. Hola, Ahí está. Hi, teacher. Hello, Hi, sir, teacher. how are you? Teacher, today I am not... Today I am not going to participate 
Why, sir? I am on the process, okay? How do you feel today? I am fine, I am fine. Only I am on the process, okay? Ah, okay, yeah. Al algo le pasó. Yes, sir. En la, en la celebración. Yes, sir. Thank you. <laughs> okay. Don Luisito, nos va a hacer falta que esté hablando, hombre. Vaya por ahí, lo están clamando, don Luis. Sí. Nos va a hacer talk. falta que hable, nos va a hacer falta. ¿Cómo va a estar callado? I don't talk this time, ¿ok? Bueno. Bueno, él sabrá, él sabrá. Maybe somebody okay. is next to him. Mm -hmm. Somebody is next to him. Control the situation. <laughs> Thank you, teacher. Ok, ok, sir, no problem. Okay, teacher, yo back. hice la tarea 17, pero toda me salió mala. No okay. sé si no entendí o okay. qué. Mm, that, that number 17 is about going to? Yes, I did it in capitals and then with no capitals and no, then. No, capital. no, okay. Me, um, me let Solo me see. tiene que poner el, el verbo to be, uh, el yeah, to uh, y el otro verbo. Yeah, you are going to use a B4. Eso es mandatorio. Creo que sí uso una forma del B, ¿verdad? Sí, ajá, puse are, are going. Eso fue la última prueba que hice, pero siempre me las tira mal. Okay. Yo creo que es porque Solo este, la número yo creo, cuatro, yo creo la que error. es porque este escribe toda la oración y solamente pide ahí nada más este lo que es el be, el going to y el verbo nada más, lo demás no se pone, por eso que las tira mal. Al principio así me hizo a mí todas me tiran mal, pero porque escribía todo y no es así. Just is going to tal cosa. Más el verbo. Solo el verbo. Sí. Uh -huh. Hasta ahí Pero nada más. Yo tengo okay. la cuatro que siempre me sale mala. Ah, ya okay. lo hice yo muchas veces y ayer. ya no entiendo. Ya no he preguntado a muchos y me sale mala siempre. El, yo el, pregunté ayer, me dijeron que es error de la el, plataforma. Es la del picnic, ¿verdad, Blanca? Sí, es esa. Correcto, igual bueno, a lo que dije yo oh, aquel día. Es, ajá. Es, 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 es. Ah, quizás. Pero se le pone lo que es el verbo y siempre lo tira error. Ok, bueno. Ahí está, si tenemos un tiempecito al final. Dale cero porque yo más que diez. Congratulaciones. Se dan cuenta. Es que yo también, callado. pero la hice como cinco veces. <risa> Por eso es que está calladito porque tú diez. Y para que no le pidan copia, él por eso está quieto. Luisito no sea malo. Yes, ajá, la cuatro la tira mal, es cierto. Está bien. Ok. Bueno, luego hablamos de la cuatro. Thank you. Ok. Wow. De la cuatro, dice. De la de Don Francisco. Number four is not working. Okay, wait for me a little bit because I'm not. Pero en las demás ya tienen solo dieces, ¿cierto? Yes. Okay. Excelente. Me gusta. Me gusta que estén así callados, callados. Eso sí no me gusta. Ok, welcome back. We are going to talk, today we are going to talk about means of transportation. What can you tell me about this? Can you name uh, five means of transportation, please? Okay, tell me. 
Paz. Caro. Bicycle. Motorcycle. Airplane. Boat. Yeah. Alguien más, alguien más. I am only Uber. Only Uber. Oh, yes, okay. sir. Okay. Excellent. Okay, somebody else, please. Sorry, what's the question? Name five uh, means of transportation. Find a means. Mencioneme Mencione cinco medios ah, de, de transporte. Bus, train, airplane, micro, microbus. Espera que se me quedó en tres. Ah, sí. Subway. Ah. Subway. Subway. Ok, subway. What else? Five. One more. Ah, eh, horse. Boat. Bike. Horse. Uh, could be horse too. <laughs> Bicycle. Bicycle. Boat. Okay, let, let me see. Motorcycle. Luis Manuel. So okay, Ana, Ana, you continue. Hello. 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 What else? Ana Judith. Motorcycle. Ah, motorcycle. 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 Okay. Motorcycle. What else? That's it. Okay, thank you, Elmer. What about you, sir? Five means of transportation. Bicycle. One. Motorcycle. Two. Car, three, taxi, mm, microbus, train. Okay. Thank you. Somebody else? That's the teacher. Elizabeth, tell me. Yes, taxi. Car, bus, train, helicopter. 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 Okay. What else? I don't remember how do you say avion in English. Airplane. 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 Okay, Edwin Palmore Flores. Hello, teacher. Tell us five means of transportation, please. Repeat, please. Could you name five means of transportation? Puede decir, no puede nombrar a cinco. Medios de transporte. Um, car. Okay. Bus. Bus. Um, truck. Truck. Uh, no remember. ¿Cómo se dice? Bicicleta. Bike. 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 Bike and and no remember teacher. Estábamos jugando el ahorcado. Ya sabe lo que le pasó, ¿verdad? Okay, Blanca Elizabeth, tell me. Play. Train, train, car, truck, oh. eh, taxi, eh, 
helicopter. Helicopter. Does it? Okay, so Maria. Jose Eduardo, okay, tell me, Jose Eduardo. Hi, teacher. <laughs> eh, sería taxi. Teacher, un, una pregunta. Y, y camión se dice trunk. It's truck. Truck. Ah, yes. pues camión. <laughs> truck. Y motorcycle. 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 Y de tren. Tren. Uh -huh. Y minivans. 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 Ah, ok. Y teacher. ¿De dónde está? Cars. Motorcycle. Bike. Sí. Uh, bus. Uh, helicopter. Helicopter. Okay. Helicopter, airplane, 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 okay, airplane. Okay. Somebody else? Huh? Try to tell me another one. No. Same. Teacher, um, truck is the same of trailer. Mm, no. Well, um, in certain point, we can say that it's, it is the same because, yeah, we are talking about uh, a big car, you know? Yeah. Yeah, but uh, remember that we can call truck uh, to a I would call here in, like in America, we call it pickup. A lo que nosotros le llamamos pickup, eh, eso sería un truck. Y hablando de pickup, ¿saben el significado de lo que es pickup? It's like uh, to tomar o agarrar, o no? Pickup puede tener diferentes significados, pero. Yeah, imagine that you don't have a car and you need that somebody give you a ride and you say, okay, could you pick me up at five o'clock, please? Or, or somebody tell you, I'm going to pick you up at eight. Pasaré a recogerte a estas horas. Ese es el significado en ese aspecto. No es como Ray. <laughs> no, the Ray is different. Okay. Yeah, give me a Ray, give me a Ray. Yeah, it's, it's different. But I was talking about the word pick up. De la palabra pick up. Que nosotros así, así. Yeah, en otro lado es truck. Okay. Um, let me see. Let me try to show you this. I don't know if you, you can see it. Just tell me the name of the, of the picture that you see. Car. Okay, car. One. What about this one? Car, motorcycle. 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 Uh, cycle. Yamaha. That, that also we can say motorbike. Motorbike. Yes. What about this one? Bus. 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 Uh, can you read here? Clean air. Clean air. Clean air. Hybrid. Hybrid, Hybrid electric. Hybrid electric bus. Electric bus. Hybrid electric bus. What is that? What is that? What is that, sir? It is a bus. bus. It is a mother bus. Okay, Bike. what about this one? Bicycle. Bike. 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 How many of you can uh, ride in a bike? Let me see. Me. All of you? Yes. ¿Cuántos de ustedes pueden andar en bicicleta? Me. Me, teacher. Ah, 
Ah, ok. Bueno, vamos a, a organizar un tour desde a San Salvador al Estino. <laughs> okay. This bicycle. Okay, what about this one? Bang. Biker box. How do you call it? Bands. Yes, band. What about this one? Let us see what happened here. Truck. 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 It is? Truck. Truck lorry. In uh, the United Kingdom, you can say lorry. Uh, teacher. Hello? What is, what is the difference the truck and lorry? Different. It is, it is the same. Es lo mismo. Lo único que en América... Eh, in North America, you can call it truck, but in Inglaterra, you can call it lorry. Ah, uh, okay, okay. What about this one? Car. But if I say truck in Inglaterra, what happened? Lorry. It's me. No me acuerdo. ¿Cómo le llaman en español? Oh, the, the, the translation, I guess that it's the same, like a, a big car, but they call it, uh, we say truck and they, they say lorry. And, and at the same, it, it is the, the meaning of this picture. Que nosotros le decimos camión, trailer. Pero generalmente la palabra trailer eh, they use it in a different way. You know, have you seen the, the trailers of some movies? It's another word that is uh, close in pronunciation. Okay, we have a horse and back. Mm, carriage, algo así? No. Excuse me? Carriage, algo así, de carruaje, no. And also they call, they could call it that way. Okay, this is the train. How many of you have a traveling train? No. Me. Okay. Like orange, like um, this red, like, like um, violet. Um, and okay, what about this one? Airplane. Airplane, okay. Right there I can see some faces of you traveling. The success. Ahí van, de, ahí van viajando al éxito. Camino al éxito. I see your faces there. Okay, what about this one? Helicopter. 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 Uh, ¿Alguien, alguien ha andado en helicóptero alguna no. vez? No. No? No, teacher. I don't believe you. Of course, maybe here in El Salvador is expensive. Yeah. But in another country, it's not expensive. Okay, we have a rocket. Uh, what about this one? Would you like balloon. to try? Would you like to try uh, in a balloon? Travel in a balloon? Yeah. Yes, teacher. It's amazing. Yeah, hot air. Okay, it's a romantic else? picture. <laughs> it's romantic. <laughs> okay. What about this one? Just, it's a, just. It's a dangerous. Is it dangerous? Yes. yes. It is the boat. Yes. Okay. And we have this, this one where you are boat. going to spend your vacation at the end. Of your eighth module, you are going to celebrate to the Bahamas, maybe. You are going to travel to the anniversary teacher. Sé que vayan haciendo la reservación una semana, se van a la Bahamas a pasear. And this one is what we know here, like panel. And let me see what else do we have. Money. Yeah, submarine. Okay, 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 okay. But I have a, another question here that I need that you answer me, please. 
So let me see. Sure. I need to configure this. Okay. Do you prefer to ride or to go around by uh, bus, taxi when you travel? Excuse me, somebody want to ask me something or tell me something? Alliance dijo teacher. Teacher, sometimes uh, driving in, in other uh, time, uh, sorry, in bus. Because because when uh, I I drive in too much, uh, it's it's very tired. Very tired. Okay. So so uh, I prefer uh, board the bus. Okay, you prefer to go by bus, so maybe all the ten of the distance you you can do it by by airplane, right? Okay. This. Yes. Uh, Salvador is a small country. For that reason, we don't have race areas in this country. Pero creo que no sería esa la excusa para no tener uh, áreas de descanso en las carreteras principales, porque hay mucha gente que viene de otros países. Y si aquí hubieran uh, race areas, como debe, como deben de ser, eh, yo creo que eso funcionaría mucho, porque la gente que viaja, de que viene de diferentes lugares con mercadería, ellos eh, descansarían ahí, podían tomar una su ducha, comprar comida, etcétera, etcétera. Cosas de las cuales, pues, eh, en lo personal envidio mucho de otros países. No sé ustedes, pero... Yes, exactly. I guess that it's really important because suddenly if you feel tired, you can... Uh, yes, sometimes some accident. Sometimes accident the rastras. Yes, mm. happen, happen because people they fall asleep. Yes. They are tired. Okay. How long have you have you drive? ¿Qué tan, qué tan, qué tan lejos ha, ha manejado? Okay. To Guatemala. Alex Guatemala, Aldana. how many hours? Sorry, teacher. I don't know. Alex Aldana drive to Managua, Nicaragua. Okay. San Pedro Sula, Tegucigalpa, okay. Guatemala. Nice. Me no, me no drive, teacher. Okay, okay. Five ¿Tiene? hours by bus. Don Luisito tiene este. Eh, ¿Cómo se llama? Conductor designado. Pichel, el Luis cuando lo llevo de copiloto se me duerme. <laughs> ah, ok. But the problem here is the, 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 the kind of street that we have. Because in my case, when I was young, of course, I used to, to drive from Washington to Miami. 18 hours. 18 hours. Yes. From the Salvador, oh. from the Salvador oh to God. Managua, teacher, uh, are 11 oh. hours. How many hours? 11. 11? Yes, sir. 11. Ah, okay. 11 hours. Yeah, as I told you before, el problema que tenemos es que las calles de acá no dejan que uno avance demasiado. Porque yo le aseguro que manejar de Washington a Miami es un montón de millas y se avanza demasiado. I remember the last year I was there, I was planning to travel uh, from Washington to Texas. But because of the pandemic, I can do it. I have to stay only just in one place. But in my case, I, I love driving, but... Uh, no, no, not at night because sometimes it's really difficult. And even when the weather is not really good, then maybe it's snowing or something like that, it's really hard. Okay, let yes, us. Teacher. And here in El Salvador, it's so, um, it's so, I don't know, bad because the traffic is very, it's very, I don't know, a lot of traffic. Yeah, and, and, and another thing is that. And the people is very 
um, impa, impa, impatient. Impatient. Okay. Impatient and noisy. And, and not only impatient, also aggressive. Aggressive, yeah. Yeah, because they don't respect uh, other, other drivers. Yeah. And uh, I, I, I remember uh, one day I was driving my work and suddenly I was uh, a little late and I was tr uh, trying to to get in a hurry, you know, but suddenly all the cars stopped. And I say, my God, how I'm going to do it. Uh, at the end, what I saw was uh, uh, a mother dog with uh, the puppy dogs crossing the street, you know. Lo que estaba sucediendo es que había ahí este la, era el esposo del de, del pato que estaba ahí o no sé si era el papá, pero iba con una línea de patitos y eso nos hizo detenernos como 15 minutos esperando que pasaran todos los patitos. Y lo mismo sucede con otros animales, pero aquí um, pueden ser Pueden ser personas las que se van atravesando y en lugar de frenar aquí, press the accelerator, you know. Yeah, it's a, yeah. well, there are a lot of things that we need to fix. But maybe one day everything is going to switch. Okay, let us continue means, okay, we are going to talk about means of transportation. Um, let me see. What about if uh, you can do it later? But what I want is that you are going to create a sentence using one of these words. It's going to be more productive for me. Luego pueden buscarlas en la sopa de letras. Ahorita lo que quizás me sería más productivo es que cada uno uh, me nombre, me haga una oración usando una palabrita de esta para ir entrando así como es más ambiente. A train, car, plane, motorcycle, subway, truck, helicopter, taxi, bicycle, and jeep. Okay, want to start telling me something about this, please? Teacher, me, I drive, I drive a car every day. Okay, you drive a car every day. Maria? I see helicopter in the sky. Ah, okay, you see, I have a seen, I have a seen. A lot of helicopters. Okay. Somebody else, please. I like the uh, travel in the subway. Uh -huh. yes. I'm going to take a taxi for a meeting tomorrow. I'm going to take a taxi. Okay. For the meeting. For the meeting. Okay, somebody else, please. So I I like I like to ride a bicycle. Uh, is is healthy. Yeah, it's really healthy. If you had the chance to do it on weekends, do it. But that is another issue here in El Salvador because. In, in the United States, there are uh, some bicycle paths where you can go only just bicycles. And right here, we need to be careful. But maybe in the capital, you have places uh, where you can go and, and, and be careful of, of the car, right? Okay. Somebody else? Okay, let us move forward, please. Okay, listen to your teacher read the conversation and practice asking for direction to places. We have a speaker A and a speaker B. Excuse me, how can I get to the airport? Well, the airport is very far away. Can you go by taxi or you can drive? Thank you. Uh, I'm going to drive, but I need to rent a car. Is there a car rental near here? Sure. It's two blocks down the street. You can go there by foot. 
things are allowed. Okay. Again. Excuse me, how can I get to the airport? Well, the airport is very far away. You can go by taxi or you can ride. Thanks. Ah, I'm going to drive, but I need to rent a car. Is there a car rental near here? Sure. It's two blocks down the street. You can go there by foot. Thanks a lot. Okay. Make a screenshot, please, if you can do it now. Hágale una captura, por favor, porque vamos a hacer un break up. But please, go to the okay, room. Teacher. Time. Le, solo les pido el favor de que cuando les asigne su aula, puedan a lo más pronto posible vayamos a, al aula con quien nos corresponde. Luego hacemos la práctica y regresamos. Please. Let me see. Okay. Okay, here we go. Here we go. I hope to see you there. To all of you. Okay, go, 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 go. Please go now, 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 now. What about you, Edwin, Claudio, Luis, Manuel, and Elmer? Elmer and Luis, Manuel, for power. Go to your rooms. Hello, teacher. Hello, sir. Eh, en, la, en la sala solo yo estaba, teacher. No llegó nadie más ahí. De verdad. Sí. Pero fue que me salí de la sala porque solo yo estaba ahí. Nadie, nadie se, se, se incorporó. Ok. Ok, ahorita reviso quién estaba. ¿En which number you were? Oh, number eight. Okay, Luis and Walter, you can work together now if you want, please. Is that possible? No.
teacher. Ay. Ahora no pasó lista, ¿verdad? ¿O sí? Let me see. I don't remember if I did. Jesus Christ. Déjenme ver si sí o no. Más creo que quizás no. No, teacher, no pasó lista. Será que me emocioné demasiado en estar hablando de otras cosas. Okay. Por el día del padre fue. Ah, bien. <risa> What's a mistake. Ya tenía listo. Ahí estamos. Ahorita mismo. Bueno, vamos a hacer. I'm going to do it uh, at the end of your participation. We are going to do it. I, uh, okay. Sí, porque ahorita los demás están en, en, en el breakout. Bueno, okay, gracias por recordarme. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Ah, no, ya regresaron. Ahí están todos. Okay, let me see. I'm going to call you one by one. Alex is there? Yes. Yes, teacher, I'm here. Okay, Ana Beatriz. Quien no conteste pierde. Ana Judith. Sir. Blanca. Present. Carlos. Alfredo. I am here. Okay, Ana Beatriz. Uh, Carlos Antonio. Present. Claudio. Present teacher. Edwin. Edwin. Present teacher. Elmer. Francisca. Present teacher. El Elmer is not present. Present teacher, Elmer. Ah, andaba lejos. Uh -huh. Gonzalo. 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 No. Ok, uh, José Eduardo. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Yeah. Carla Marisol. Present teacher. Marcela. Present teacher. Luis Alfonso. Luis Alfonso. Present teacher. Luis Manuel. Walter. Present teacher. And Nestor. Present. Ariel no. Sí. Present teacher. Ariel. Luis Manuel, present teacher. Ah, Luis Manuel Muñoz. Ok, thank you. Present okay, okay. Okay, 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 I got Luis it. Luis Manuel. Yeah, yeah, I got it, I got it. Ok, let us uh, perform the, the conversation, please. Do it now. Volunteers, voluntarios que quieran hacer la conversación. Ana Beatriz. Yes. Okay. Excuse me. Excuse me, how can I get to the airport? Who's your partner? ¿Con quién está? Carlos, Carlos Eduardo, creo que se llama. No, Eduardo Guzmán. Ah, pues. <ríe> ahorita, <Eduardo>. ahorita. <ríe> Excuse me, how can I head? Eh, ah, usted es la primera, vaya. Siga. Excuse me, how can I get to the airport? Uh, well, well, the airport is very far, far away. You, you can go by taxi or you can drive it. Thanks. Mm, I'm going to drive, but I need to rent a car. Is there a car rental near here? Sure, it's two blocks down the street 
you can go there by foot. Thanks a lot. Okay, okay, thank you. Somebody else? Me, teacher. Okay, good. With Claudio. No. Okay. Excuse me. How can I get to airport? To the airport? Well, the airport is very far away. You can go by taxi or you can drive. Thanks. Well, I'm going to drive, but I need to rent a car. Is there a car rental near here? Sure. It's two blocks down the street. You can go there by foot. Thanks, hello. Okay. Somebody else? Elizabeth? Who wants to do it? Anyone? Me teacher, but nobody connected with me. Ah, oh, okay. I don't know why. Somebody wants to help her, please. Alguien quiere ayudarme? Me, sí. me, Carlo Antonio. Okay, Carlo Antonio. Excuse me. How can I get to the airport? Well, the airport is very far away. You can go by taxi or you can drive. Thanks. Oof. I'm going to drive, but I need to rent a car. Is there a rent a car near here? Sure. It's two blocks down the street. You can go there by foot. Thanks a lot. Intercambiamos, Marcelito. Thank you. Okay. okay. Excuse me. How can I get? Oh, sorry. Excuse me. How can I get to to the airport? Well, the airport is very far away. You can go to buy taxi or you can drive. Thanks. Mm, I want to drive, but I need to rent a car. Is there a rent? Is there a car rent near here? Sure. It is to block down the strip. You can go there by foot. Thanks a lot. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. Okay. Thank you. Let us move forward, please. Okay, in the next activity, uh, we are going to work in pairs. You need to write the name of three different places around your company and take your asking how to get to those places. And then uh, right here in the top space, you are going to write down the name of the place, the means of transportation that you are going to use, and also the question and the answer that you are going to use. But set places around your company, I don't know kind of places you have around your company. Lugares que estén ahí a los alrededores de, de su compañía, cerca de su compañía, could be, yeah. Hello. Okay, teacher. Okay, I need I need at, at, at least three examples. Three participants, please. Teacher, I I don't understand the question. Ah, okay. Escriba los nombres de tres diferentes lugares mm -hmm. uh, cerca de su compañía. Could be okay around. And then you are going to take your asking how to get to those places. For, for example, tell me three places near to your company. Um, Antiguo Cuscatlán. Pero no sé. Si hay... Okay, but, but specific places. I don't know, could be buildings, uh, markets, uh, 
restaurant. Exacto, la Texaco, teacher. Sí, entra ah, también, ¿verdad? Ah, the gas station, ok. Uh -huh. The gas station. Y... Castillo oh. Venturoso, sorry. Excuse me, sir. Castillo Venturoso. Ah, okay. <ríe> Galerías Escalón, teacher. <ríe> <risa> Mira, don Luisito. ¿Cuál es la, don Luis? Tremendo. El castillo venturoso donde lleva a las princesas. Wow, 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 sorry, wow, wow. sorry, sorry. My, my office is near Castillo Venturoso. Ah, after, okay. is, and, uh, uh, after is a banco agrícola comercial. Ok. How can I get, how can no, I get to the... Sir, sorry, no, Elia. How can I get to the Castillo? If if I'm in your office, how can I get to the Castillo Venturoso? Sorry, teacher. Desde su oficina, how can I get to the Castillo Venturoso? Two two block, teacher. Two block, but I need to. Yes, yes sir. As soon as I leave your, your office, how can I get to the left, to the right? It's right ahead. Tell me. It's a left. It's a left. Uh, two blocks is a left of my office. Okay. Two okay. The, what about the means of transportation that, that you are going to use to arrive there? Tomorrow, everybody, I look at me. Okay. <laughs> No, it's just an exercise in order that you speak English, you know, don't worry about that. No, teacher, sorry, it's a joke, okay. Yeah, I, I know too. Okay. But you have an advantage there. Usted tiene una ventaja porque si el Castillo Venturoso está cerca, you don't spend in, in taxi, you don't spend in, in, in gasoline with your car, you can go by foot. Yes, teacher. Uh, it's to my house, uh, I, I live in Mexicanos. Okay. In car, in car, is a uh, ten minute. Okay, ten minutes. Ten minutes to drive. Okay. Okay. Excellent. Somebody else. Hello. For me, it's a modern, modern funeral. Funeral is moderno. It's está cerca de la oficina. How can I get there? Can you go? No, it's can, can, can I go to funeral, modern funeral and um, be working? <laughs> it's it's, it's very a one block. It's a one block teacher. A ah, one block. Yes, yeah. sir. Okay. I go uh, working. Ah, okay, excellent. Somebody else? Me, teacher. Okay. And my work is between um, Pollo Campero okay. and Supermarket Super Selectos. And, and you can go by foot okay, because right. it's to block. To block to my job. Okay, excellent. Okay, let us move a little bit forward, please, because we need to talk more about and see what's going on here. Okay, okay, what about asking for direction? Expression, we are going to use, is there a, around here, imagine, uh, imagine I have a heritage and I need to get uh, some, Painkiller. Do you know what is painkiller? Yes. Okay. What about the rest? No. Ah, okay. I need to be sure that all of you know what I'm saying. Imagine that I got a headache. Imagine that I have a headache in my work. And suddenly I need to get some painkiller. And I ask the question using the fair expression. Is there a pharmacy around here? How you are going to answer this question? Or somebody is, is driving and suddenly uh, realize the need uh, to get some 
fuel of gas, you know? And somebody asked you, is there any gas station around here? Okay, repeat, is there a... Are you following me or not? Is there a... Um... Is there a... Is there a... Okay, why we are using this article here? Oh, you need to be clear. ¿Por qué estamos usando, uh, en este caso, eh, eh, this word as an article determiner? ¿Por qué estamos usando ese A ah, pensando en que la palabra que va a continuar es? ¿Cuándo usamos A? Ah, ¿Cuándo usamos AN? Ok, ese es otro tema. But in this case, we are going to... In consonant, in is AM. In violin. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Ahí está una información In consonant, is A, is, is A, in violin, is AM. Yeah, not all. Okay. Okay, another uh, way how you can ask question is, uh, how can I get to, if you need to, how can I get to the gas station? How can I get to the balloon hospital? Yeah. How can I get to, what is the name, Don Luis? Castillo Venturoso. Castillo Venturoso o Oloso. Ay, gacho. Hasta ahora caí que es el que es famoso también esa cosa. <laughs> Yo siguiéndole la corriente, por eso que alguien le dijo, ahí es donde lleva las princesas. <risas> Ajá, ok. Parte del show. Ok, es parte del show, don Luis. Sí. Ok, ok, ok. Another question could be, where is that? Where is the pharmacy? That is not polite to you. Ya. Yeah? In this case, teacher, where is the office? Your office. Where is the office? Yeah. Okay. Where is the main office? Where is the bank? Agricola. Where is the, where is the bank? Okay. Where is the bank? Okay. Otro ejemplo, rapidito, así, rapidito, rapidito, para que no se me duerma. Where is the, the police station? Where is the police station? Okay. Where is the coffee, is the Mr. Station? Pedro? Ah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Sponsor is café, café, don, café, Mr. Pedro. Como es café, no es de que ven a café, no que café es el establecimiento, todo ese, ese es café, ¿verdad? El café de don Pedro. Across the street. Okay, how far is that? How far is the bank from? You can use another word here from, from the, for example, from the office. How far is the bank from? Five, blo five blocks, six blocks, ten blocks. Okay, okay. Turn, okay. Okay, okay. And take a look at this. Use polite expression like, excuse me, or can you tell me to ask for directions? Remember, every time that you are going to ask for direction, you can use, excuse me, or can you tell me I'm where... Okay. Sorry, teacher. Sorry, teacher. In this case, I have a question. Okay. Yeah. In Spanish, eh, cuando digo, can you tell me? Y cuando digo, can you say me? Ah, el tell and el say. Okay. okay. El Let tell me. y el say. Yeah, tell and say. Let me look for the better example that I can give you. Ok, en español es como cuando el tel, cuando dice, cuéntame algo, ¿sí? Tell me something, ¿ya? Yeah? And, for example, uh, when you... Hay una canción que dice, say you, say me, teacher. Ya, yeah? ya, yeah, I have heard. Y eso es como tell you, tell me, es lo que quiere decir Luis, se puede usar o como no se puede usar. No, 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 no. I, I, I guess that I have some information about that because sometimes it's kind of tricky. But, uh, ah, okay. yeah, pero regresando a la pregunta de Don Luis, generalmente I'll tell, it is like when somebody says, tell me, tell him, dile a él, dile a ella, ya? Y él say, uh, you... Yeah, for me. 
Yeah, you say me, yeah. It's for me, okay. Or if you say, she said, ella dijo, she said that, ella dijo que, ¿sí? She, she tell. No, she said. She said. Or she told me, okay. Stephen, she told me, yeah. Okay, uh, remember at the end, uh, if you want, me recuerda al final si quiere, o me manda un mensajito, creo que tengo unas diapositivas explicando el tell y el say. Okay, okay. teacher, thank you. Okay, just send me a, a message. And I'm going to, to, to share with you, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay, now we switch uh, given direction, expression that we are going to use. Okay, we are going to say go to the corner of and then to left, to right, uh, past the, the cafeteria, past the bank, past the Pollo Campero, go straight ahead on Boulevard Venezuela, yeah? And you can mention the, uh, the name of the avenue too until you get to El Salvador del Mundo, hasta que usted llegue al Salvador del Mundo. Yeah, and you continue doing that kind of explanation. It's, yeah, it's between that and you mentioned two different places, between the bank and the, and the pharmacy, for example. Or also you can say it is across from the Marriott Hotel, or it is in front of Yes, try to read it, please. Try to read it, please. Try to read it. What kind of volado are you talking, sir? Okay. Do you have it? Yes? Yes, teacher. Okay, remember that in order to give direction is different to ask for. Okay? Bueno. Okay, and also uh, I'm going to add uh, an extra information that sometimes we, we use transition. When we talk about transition, I'm talking about some words that I use in order to uh, continue talking, use this word to connect the ideas. Imagine that you say, okay, you need to pass the bank and after that you need to turn left uh, and then you are going to continue straight ahead for two blocks and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. A eso es lo que le llamamos transition. In my case, uh, I consider that it's really important that you know these words. After that, then, next, when you get to go, and finally you arrive to your destination. Okay, try to keep in mind this word, after, that, then, next, when, when you get to, when you get to the, to the park, uh, then go to the left, and finally you are going to be in the 75 Avenue, and then so on. You can start using these words, okay? Así, rapidito. Alguien, hágame una oración usándome alguno de esos transition, please. Me teacher, when you go, hey, when you get to beach, beach to Ibutulutan, what your name is, it? the beach is, a, I'm sorry, I don't remember. El Espino Beach? The beach in, 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 in Sulutan, the best in El Salvador. Mm -hmm. uh, what, is, what, is, what is the name, the beach? 21 kilometer. One kilometer? El Espino teacher. Sorry. Yeah, the, 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 when yeah. you when you when you go when you when you go to when you go to go 
eh, Beach es eh, el estilo, ¿no? Ok. Ok. Mi teacher, can I help you after my lunch? Ok, can I help you after my lunch? Ok. But, but what about using this word just uh, asking or giving directions? That is our major issue that we are talking about today. Ok, I'm sorry. Me, teacher. Okay, Nestor. Um, the gas station are after after Plaza Merliot. But the gas station is is yeah, is because after. it's singular. Yeah, sorry. Okay, okay, no problem. Okay, thank you. Somebody else. Teacher, Hello? maybe the, the supermarket is next to the ice cream store. Okay. Next to the Saritas. Okay. Yeah. Or oh, next to La Neveria. Oh, here in Santa Ana is very famous. El Sin Rival is a, is a natural ice cream. Ah, okay. It's, it's delicious. For this area, there is one that I, but in fact, I never had tried to pronounce it. I don't remember exactly, but what I remember is that I have a, like a four letter L. Creo que tiene como tres L o cuatro L el nombre. No me recuerdo como es. But it's, it's naturally. It's, it's, it stays. It's yellow, with... yellow. Yeah, it's something like that, but it stays, yeah. it stays yeah. nice. Sabe bien. Sure, I have a question. Okay, tell me. Tell me, tell me. In the last thing, when you get to, when you, when you get to is, get to go or? No, 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 I, no. When you get to the pizza, or when you get to the bank, when you stay llega, al banco, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Then go to the left. Entonces de ahí vaya a la izquierda, etcétera, etcétera, etcétera. Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. Okay, okay, okay. Thank you. Yeah. When you get to remember that the question when we are asking for a direction, we we say how how can I get to the police station. Okay, no question. Okay, example. I got an example here. Excuse me. How can I get to the hospital? Go straight ahead on uh, Kings Avenue and turn left when you get to the river street, past the gym and the post office. The hospital is between the school and the church across from the hotel. Okay, would you like to try uh, try to do it, please, with somebody? Teacher, sorry. Tell me. Please repeat the pronunciation river. River? And turn left when you get the river on river. No, no, river. 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 Okay, teacher, thank you. No rider. I remember that I have a student in the university. And suddenly uh, we were talking about travel. And I asked the question and say, okay, tell me what kind of document we need to travel to another country. Yeah. Teacher. I, hello. Esta era la esta era la 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 oración que le preguntaba aquel día, uh, no ayer cuando porque la distancia era muy larga entonces go straight ahead o sea sigue derecho derecho ve sí go straight ahead ah okay o go alone also o go alone es lo que le decían go straight ahead sí como que dice es como que sigo derecho y llegó hasta hasta Kings Avenue yes verdad and then to left when you get to River Street yeah okay okay 
Okay, 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 okay. I forgot what I was uh, telling you. Okay, I'm going to continue. Somebody wants to read it for me, please? Two volunteers. Excuse me, how can I get to the hospital? How can I Elizabeth? get to the hospital? Hospital. Okay. Going straight ahead on, on King Avenue and turn left when you get to River City, past the gym on the post office. The, the, hospital. Hospital, the hospital is between the school and the girls across from the hotel. How do you say this word? Short. Oh? Short. short. It's short. Yeah, it's short. Sure. The chart. And what about this one? Post office. Post office. Post office. Post office. Post office. Ya no la separen así. Post office. No, post office. Como que estoy diciendo el post, el toffee. De post dos. office. De una vez. <laughs> okay. Ya yeah, post office. Okay. Post office. Sure. Oh. Pero, pero como el inglés siempre lo unen cuando es de una consonante a, a la vocal. Ah, pero cuando, cuando, cuando los, los norteamericanos están aprendiendo el español y unen las consonantes con las vocales en español, eso te oye feo, teacher. <risa> ¿Cómo estás? <risa> Le dicen a uno. Yeah, yo tenía eh, un jefe que él quería aprender español. Y una vez llego y él no hay nada que hacer para usar el español y me dice, rápido, rápido, rápido. Ah, sí. Sí, es le cierto. digo, no, le digo, no, es rápido, 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 me decía. Ok, nadie bueno, más. O cuando, ah, eso, o cuando eso, aprendí eso, en teacher. Guatemala. Hello, teacher, hello. teacher, y eso es bien peligroso, fíjese. Sí, eso de ir rápido Porque... es peligroso. No, peligroso de que, de que, uno quisiera, de, no, de que, de que ellos quisieran hablar español y uno, y uno quererles entender también. Yes. Fíjense que nosotros íbamos a mover una carga, era, era, un, era uno, un, este, un, un instalador de un equipo de aquí de Dallas. Iban a instalar un equipo aquí en el Seguro Social y era, una, era un contenedor que, que pesaba cerca de cuatro toneladas. Eh. Y, era una, y era una bajadita, una bajada en el Seguro Social. Era una bajada que teníamos que hacerlo con cuidado. Y él, en lugar de, de, de que él quería hablar español, en lugar de decir, este, él decía, por decir el alto que, que para que se para que para haciéramos fuerza para parar con, con, con la herramienta, la, el contenedor, él decía otro, otro. Entonces lo tomamos en cuenta como que quiere decir otro, o sea, otro, otro empujón, otro, otro impulso. <risa> Ajá, eh, eh. Eh, sí, a ver si sí, por, por poco ahí, y es ahí, para donde me aparece una, una persona ahí. Sí, pero ahí eh, dos cosas. La fuente de donde él había aprendido a decir esa palabra o donde la había oído o, o, o sí. él mal en, entendió cuando alguien trató de explicarle algo. For, for that reason, I consider myself, according to my experience, that I've been uh, uh, in some places working, uh, that we need to be really sure about what they say and what they need. We need to be really careful about it. Yeah. Debemos de ser muy cuidadosos y saber realmente qué es lo que ellos necesitan, más si se trabaja con herramientas. Exacto. Y en mi caso, por ejemplo, cuando me mandaban a traer alguna herramienta que no conocía, eh, pues tenía que preguntar algo importante que sí debemos de saber es que en inglés como en español existe un lenguaje técnico para diferentes eh, fields entonces sí. ah, en ese caso por ejemplo yo tuve que hacer una especialización en seis diferentes fields porque eh, manejar términos por ejemplo de medicina es una cosa en las leyes es otra en la parte que más he trabajado de la ingeniería también es, es sumamente complejo porque hay un montón de nombres de instrumentos que generalmente eh, uno no los usa pues a diario y ahí tiende a confundirse. 
but that is another issue. Okay, yeah. let us see this uh, this map that I have here. It's uh, very clear. I need that uh, you practice. Let me put something here. I'm going to to start. Let me see where we are going to start in order to that you can interrupt. Maybe it could be right here in the up street. I'm going to the next here. Okay, you are going to be here. Can you see it? Pueden ver el mapita, sí? Yes, teacher. Yes, okay. teacher. You are, yes, you are there. Okay, one is going to ask you uh, the question. Uno va a hacer la pregunta y el otro le va a otro voluntario porque no puedo. Uh, bueno, que sí puedo, puedo estarle diciendo quién, pero mejor así. Alguien hace la pregunta. Okay, take a look. Take a look at the places that we have. For example, I would like to ask you this question. How can I get to the Italian restaurant? Somebody wants to give me an answer, please. The volunteer, how can I get to the okay. Italian restaurant? Italian restaurant. Yes. I tell the question, teacher. Okay. From Elizabeth. <laughs> Elizabeth. Yes. How can I get to the Jewel? Jewel I don't see you. Jewel is short. Ah, yeah, the Jewel is short. Okay. Mm, is mm, Luis, I try for it's difficult for me in one direction. Okay, but try, try to do it. Try to do it, please. Mm, it's try, the try, try, <laughs> try, try, try early. Try early. Okay. Pero de dónde? De, de, de la flechita so roja. Did, yes, sir. Yes, yes, madam. ¿Cómo es? You, you drive you in, in a street up, the street in the left. No. Turn, turn. In the, in the left. Y you drive in Second Avenue. In the, in the right. Y you drive in. Street High Avenue. Yeah, you go. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, I, 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 I'm lost. I love Elizabeth. <laughs> do, do you do you understand me? <laughs> thank you, Eddie. Thank you, Eddie. Hey, okay, it's somebody it's else. Wants to... Okay. Okay, somebody else. Ya ve que Luis se reír, verdad? Ya ve que Luis se reír. <laughs> okay, somebody else wants to answer uh, the question. Sorry, I'm... teacher. Sorry, teacher. In this case, in this case, uh, I look the Jiguli store. The okay. case. Yes. It, it start in the in the red mark. Okay. Yes. Uh, go ahead uh, of the street. Uh, Hasta, para decir hasta, teacher. Until. Sorry. Until. And here, by street. Okay, teacher. Around left, my street. From Me, teacher. Hill Avenue. Turn right in the around, okay. Sorry, teacher. No problem, sir. No problem. Okay. Somebody else wants to try? Okay, teacher, me, Blanca Elizabeth. Ah, okay. Okay. Excuse okay. me, miss. How can I get to train station? Blanca Elizabeth. Sorry, sorry, que no veo. <laughs> it's very easy. Down the street, train station. No sé si está bien así. Oh, 
Tuh, 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 nafis. Somebody wants to give a hand? Me, teacher. Okay, do it. Um, let me see. Um, Jose Eduardo. How can I get to fire department? I pregunto <laughs> Toma. Take it in time out. Um, repeat, please. Yeah. How can I get to fire department? The bomberos, aquí. Fire department. Fire department. Uh, um, no. Enough? I don't know. You are here. You are in, in, in the arrow here. It is hey. easy. Street, how, you are, how are you are going to say uh, not street and, and it's go straight go straight ahead the electric sigue derecho and find a street corn strike in may street Next main strip. Yeah. Uh, but, but what right. about this in this, this part? Next you can you can okay. Right here you can say go to the corner, yeah, hasta la esquina, then to right, right on, and to uh, left. on, on Pine Street, then go and straight ahead. Yeah, for two blocks. The fire department is in front of furniture. Furniture. Uh, there are different ways how you can yeah, yeah. you can say it. Okay. Okay. What else? Tell me. Que yo lo diga, Oh. Recuerdan que ya vimos un vocabulario de cómo dar direcciones, cómo pedir direcciones. And also we already talked about some expressions that we can use in order to, to yes, give an address. Eso me queda. I don't have I don't have an idea. You don't have any idea about that? No. A mí no se me quedan las direcciones ni en español, menos en inglés. Yes, but right here we are, we have the map. Okay. Uh, what about how can I get to the toy store? Toy store. Yeah, how can I get to the toy store? Well, it goes to train train station. You see. Toy store. It's right in front of Chinese restaurant. Italian restaurant. Yeah, it's Next. there in, in red. Can you see it? Yeah. But okay, how can I get to Toy Story? I can idea. Tell me. No idea? For me, no. Only, only, only can say you drive in the car is free. Mm. Okay. Okay. I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to it's on Main Street. Okay, now you are going to be here in this size. The first street. Okay, you are here. 
you are here. And you need to go to, let me see, to the bookstore. Okay. How can I get to the bookstore? Me. Okay, Carlos. And go, go straight ahead. One block in until Main Street. To the left. Hmm. Uh, no. Two, two <laughs> block. Two, two block. And to the left. Uh, go 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 uh, uh, go straight ahead on on a street uh, until two one block uh, in across from the bookstore is the movie theater. The movie theater. Theater. Movie theater. Movie. The movie theater. Okay, somebody else. Me, teacher. Okay. Okay, so difficult, but I tried. Um. Okay, but let me switch the play. Let me okay. switch the play. Okay. I'm going to. Let me see. Let me see. Let me try to. Let me try to, to do something here. Let me see. Somebody's trying to tell me. So. I have a question. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Lady, uh, how can I get to the gym? Tell me. Okay. And you stay in Pierce Avenue. Is right? How you are going to tell me? Oh, you need to walk for one block to Main Street. Okay, imagine, then, imagine, that I'm, imagine that I'm driving, then I need to get to the gym. Okay, How you need to, to work. You need, you need, you need to try to um, Main Street. And then across the, the street. And you need to down, down the street. I don't down, down the street. Ah, down the street. Down the street, yeah. To Pine Street and to your left. And for about two blocks, and the Jimmy and you need to uh across train station, train train station, and next to train station is the gym in front of Chinese restaurant. Mm -hmm. Is but, right. <laughs> but you say tour left. Just right. Usted dijo, gire a la izquierda. No, no, no. It's true, right? Ah. In, in the in the long in the dumb strip in the long strip hasta abajo de la calle. Pero como hay dos, está la primera salida y tiene que ser hasta el abajo de la calle. <laughs> <laughs> dumb <Okay>. strip. <laughs> okay, it's very easy. You can say okay. Uh, if you want to get to the gym, go straight ahead on for two or yeah, for two and a half block on yeah. Pine Street, and then you need to turn right. Yeah. And yeah. You can continue that. But what I want is that you also need that that you use the word previously. We have started. Ahí es donde necesitamos las palabras que previamente estuvimos viendo. Que next, then, and finally, all the words, all those words. Okay, let me see what else. Teacher. Hello. In this case, is, is right, say, uh, you can go, you can go straight to the off road. 
to the off road. Yeah. Mm, maybe we can use the kind of expression that sometimes uh, it's better to to be very clear instead of use the, the those words. Okay. Okay. Okay, somebody else. Okay, no, no, no. Let me see what else do we have because because the time, the time of life, time of life. Then see. Ah, uh ah, -huh. right here is a little difficult. Yeah, but before that you see, let me show you something that I have here. Okay, 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 okay. We need to take a look at this little chart that I have here. Okay, I, I, I consider that you are able to see it. What's going on here? Okay, how to use get and go? Is, I need that you have a clear how you are going to use get and go. Look at the word symbols and complete the sentences below. How can I get to the trade center? I'm going to rent a car as soon as I get to Panama. I usually get to the office at 6.30 a.m. Then the explanation say use get to ask for direction or to emphasize the idea of could be motion from A to B or could be a revolve. Which one is the right one? ¿Cuál de las dos es la correcta? Choose one, please. ¿Me están comprendiendo esa parte o no? Yes, teacher. Estamos usando get como que estamos preguntando, por ejemplo, how can I get to the trade center? Ahí estamos, vamos a usar get. Sí, pero aquí en, a la hora de completar el ejercicio dice use get to ask for direction or to emphasize the idea of. Use get para a preguntar por direcciones o para enfatizar la idea de de qué. Motion from A to B o arrival. ¿Cuál de las dos será la correcta? Tell me. Arrival. Arrival. From A to B. Eh, motion de movimiento, moverse, en, pero casi lo mismo, teacher. Bueno, motion de movimiento y este es trasladarse de un lado a otro. Yes. Ok, no lo resuelva no, todavía. <risas> ok, tranquilo, todavía no lo resuelva. Vayámonos al otro lado. Dice, how do, you, how do you walk to work? I'm going to go to the conference center after I check in. I go home around 7 p.m. Use go to specific, to specify, sorry, to specify the means of transportation or to emphasize the idea of motion from A to B or arrival. The exercise oh. two is a arrival. Which one? For arrival. Which one? Yes, teacher, go is for arrival. Is that true or not? What do you think? 
You get this for motion, chair, for motion chair. from A to B. Mm -hmm. I think so, too. Okay. In Espanol, teacher. In Espanol, there are colors. You get asked for the direction of the... What is it? You get that for motion. Este get, dice que get lo usa cuando hay que, cuando hay que mencionar el movimiento o la dirección que tiene que tomar. Y el co usa. Vale, le voy a dar copia. Mire, ahí está. Puede ser en bicicleta, submarino, en avión. Ahí está, ya le di copia. Go is equal to the whole movement and get the end of a movement. Vaya, ahora denme la respuesta. Ay, wait. El que se levantó no lo vio. Habla del medio de transporte y el destino, teacher. El que es... Sí, pero aquí, enfatizando aquí, vamos a usar get para preguntar direcciones o enfatizar la idea de movimiento de la A a la B o de llegada. De llegada. El get de llegada. Ah, ok. I usually get to my office at 6 a.m. Y aquí dice, use go to specify the means of transportation or to emphasize the idea of Motion from A to B. Is that right? According to this? Yes, yes. or no? Is that clear enough or no? Yes. So, so. No, no, no. Eso de so, so no me gusta. <laughs> Desde que supe qué que significaba so, so en chino. No me pregunte porque no le voy a decir. No, pero so, so. aquí es de, de inglés, teacher, no es de yes, chino. Yes, but I relate it with the other languages. Yeah, and you got some example go. Teacher, go? Este, entonces el go se usa en, en, bueno, en movimiento, pero cuando tengo ya un destino predeterminado, por ejemplo, yo voy a la casa. Y el get es el final del movimiento. El final del movimiento. Yes. Example, I usually go by metro at 8 a.m. And usually get to my destination at... Yeah, 20 hours. Uh -huh. Está claro el ejemplo, sí, ¿verdad? Yes. Yes, teacher. Y los demás se me durmieron, ¿ok? Yes, yes. teacher. Yesterday, yes. I went to the Naval Museum and I had a great time. We got there at 17 hours. Mire, aquí está hablando ya en tiempo pasado, ¿ves? ¿eh? Ayer fui, dice, al Museo Naval y la pasé muy bien. No me va a decir alguien, ahí no dice así, ahí dice que I have a great, que yo tuve un gran tiempo. <ríe> sí, ya dijo, we have to say it. And we, we got there at 70 hours. Ok. Ok, entonces ahí sí quedamos claros ya con esto, ¿sí? Yes. Ojo, necesito que les, quede, que les quede claro porque yo creo que de esto le sale eh, un ejercicio que lo van a hacer mañana. Ok, teacher. Tomorrow is Saturday, teacher. Ah, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I guess. But, but me maybe, no. I, I don't know when you are going to do it. And talking about Saturday y hablando de sábado, mañana es el día que actualizo notas. Espero que todos hayan ya Today, realizado las actividades. Tomorrow no, teacher. ¿Ah? Next. Eh, hasta el lunes. Sí, pero en mi caso sí, yo tengo que actualizar las notas de la semana para solo dejar la última que sería la del lunes o martes. Ah, yo estaba confiado que hasta el lunes, teacher. No, o sea, yo voy a actualizar lo último el del día martes porque de lo que veamos el lunes siempre habrá una actividad que hacer el martes. I believe that. And another thing is, uh, I don't know how long uh, we are going to take it in order to fill the, the, the format. No sé cuánto tiempo nos vamos a tardar para llenar la, la, la encuesta. 
La vez pasada les dieron cuánto? Maybe 20 minutes, teacher. Es, es easy. Media hora, siempre. One teacher. hour, teacher. Ah, oh, one hour, ok. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Ok, no Eight problem. Tonight. <laughs> ok, ok. Well. Ok, let, let us uh, try to solve this exercise. Complete the statement with get or go. Sometimes both options are possible. Que les quede claro esto, que algunas veces ambas opciones son posibles. Check your answer with another pair. And we have number one. We are going to buy a shutter when we get to the airport. Claro, si ya dijimos que este sería un arrival. Okay, I'm going to give you two minutes to do it. Please do it, do it, do it now. Don't tell me, don't tell me. Just do it. Solve it, please. Dos minutos para resolverlo o tres. Démosle ahorita. Let's do it, let's do it. Quien termine primero solo me dice, it's done. Finish teacher. It's done. Okay. Finish. Okay. And Finish. Teacher. Finish teacher. Es Me too, teacher. Sí. I finish teacher. Yes. Yes. Somebody else, somebody else, somebody else, somebody else. Please, 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 please. Over, turn this over, turn this over. Luis Manuel Muñoz is there? Yes, teacher. Okay, according to my schedule, we need to talk today at the end of the session. Is that possible, sir? Uh, yes. Okay. That works. Okay, uh, who wants to give me the answer for the, the second? Alex, Sophie? Uh, how do how do you give me an answer, please? How do me what, teacher? Excuse me. I don't know. The second one, me? Sophie. How do you, Alex Sophie? How do you get to work, Sophie? The car. Okay.
What about number three, please? Who? Me too? No. And someone else. Someone else, please. Someone else. The trainer, is, the trainer is going to go to the production plant after the meeting. The trainer, the trainer is going to go to the production plant after the meeting, but also we can use get. Okay. Number four. Excuse me, Excuse how me. can I get to the, to the bus station? How can I get to the bus station? Okay, number five. The bank is really near, you can go by foot. The bank is really near, you can? You can go by foot. By foot. By foot. 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 Food. Food. Okay. Y el plural de, 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 de food, ¿cuál es? Food. Food. Fit. Es fit. 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 Yeah. yeah. Okay. Esos son de los plurales irregulares. Okay, number six. Number six, please. Are you, are you? I want to I'm going to call you when I get to the hotel. Okay, I'm going to call you when I get to the hotel. To the hotel. Okay. okay, thank you, thank you. Let me see what else I have here. Oh man, I have a lot of information for you today, but let us see this the small one, okay. <laughs> Okay, the last try. Uh, let me see. I need to get to the Plaza Ula Ula. Somebody tell me how can I get there, please. Only one, only one, no more than one. Solo uno, solo uno. Plaza Ula Ula teacher is between uh, No, no, no. Yeah, yeah. Remember that I have an X right here. Vamos a salir desde la X. ¿Cómo llego hasta ahí? Driving. Tell me. How can I get there? Take a bus. <laughs> ah, okay. I can take a bus. But I need to know where is uh, the okay, bus. Teacher. If the, if the bus is going to be in the 6th okay. Avenue. Okay, teacher. Okay, Alex, tell me, Alex. Did you drive um, and go straight ahead um, for Street Poniente? Turn left, one block. Um, in Alameda, Cuscatlan, you turn strike one block and turn left in Ruben Darío Street. Uh -huh. Okay. And three block. Maybe three block. And you and you strike. Is Plaza Ula Ula. Uh -huh. By the corner next to what? Yeah, we can use different, okay? Okay, let me see. So let me try another one. Uh, I need to go to Plaza Morazan. How can I get there? Plaza Morazan, the last one, the last one, please, the last one. Tell me. In fact, Hello? 
you you drive you drive in on Wing Avenue Sur. And in, in which one? Two Avenue and Second Second Avenue. In, in the Second Avenue South. Okay. And and then in the right. Um, okay, in, okay. La Plaza no, but yeah, yeah, okay, it's, it, it's, it's right, but you can tell me, okay, uh, go straight ahead for three blocks, vaya recto por tres cuadras, and... Ay, aquí yo estaba viendo la Plaza Libertad. Yeah, eh, about, sueño, Plaza Morazán, okay, okay, okay. Es el sueño. Ok, I'm going to stop sharing this. Let me see your system now before you leave. Alguien está celebrando porque hoy es viernes. Ahí se escucha la yeah. música. Maybe. Tomorrow is day. He's getting ready to go to the, I don't know the places where that you used to go. No sé qué lugares son los que frecuentan ya estas horas de la noche. Pues de la clase se van. Es más, ahorita ya han de tener el carro encendido. Okay, Alex Humberto. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Uh, Ana Beatriz. Present. Thank you. Ana Judith. You did, you did, you did. Are you there, Blanca? Present. Carlos? Present. Carlos Antonio? Present. Claudio? Present. Edwin? Present. Elmer? Present. Eh, Elizabeth? Present, teacher. Salo? Salo's not here today. Okay. Jose Eduardo. Present teacher. Eh, Carla Marisol. Present teacher. Marcela. Present teacher. Thank you. Luis Alfonso. Sí, present teacher. And Luis Manuel. Present teacher. Walter. Present teacher. Ariel. Nestor. Mr. Mr. Ok, before you leave, antes de que se vayan, solo recordarles que revisen por favor la información que se le ha enviado para la encuesta. Revísela detenidamente, vea de dónde va a sacar eh, toda la información que se le pide, tenga la lista para solo copiar y pegar. No le pido de favor, please, no la vaya a hacer antes. Hagámosla todos juntos. No se vaya a poner a hacerla antes y le vaya a dar a enviar porque eso es un tiro en recámara que si jala el gatillo se dispara y ya no podemos regresar la bala. Solo Hasta... abrimos el link y lo revisamos, Link. Mm, más creo que eso lo pueden hacer en el vídeo que, que se les ha enviado. Porque el correo un link nos ha mandado un link. Les han enviado un link. Okay. Sí, a mi correo sí. un link me ha, corre... me ha caído. Sí, ok, sean cuidadosos. Pero ese es de la encuesta, teacher, es, es el... El mismo link es el de la encuesta. Ok, ok. okay. Sí lo pueden revisar, pero sean cuidadosos y que no les vaya a ganar la curiosidad y le vayan a dar a enviar, porque, eh, bueno, yo estoy dándoles las indicaciones que me han pedido que les dé para que todos lo hagamos, porque vamos a tener un tiempo para hacerlo. Ya les dije si pueden tener su... Eh, quien tenga la oportunidad de tener un, una computadora sería mucho mejor para copiar y pegar porque hay algunos datos que nos tardamos demasiado y se corre el riesgo de que a la hora de estar escribiendo se les pueda olvidar algún número de esos, entonces para evitar eso es mejor copiar y pegar algunos datos okay, y, de ahí los, y revisemos por favor el video, si hay alguna pregunta, les ayudo eh, si hay alguna duda en la plataforma igual, ya dije no es que les voy a dar la respuesta pero sí les puedo dar ejemplos cómo pueden usarlo 
Y bueno, ¿qué más decirles? Fin de semana. Ok, teacher. Enjoy, enjoy your weekend. Thank uh, you with you too. And I hope to see you enjoy. the last class that is going to be on Monday. And try okay. to do your homeworks. And thank you very much for being here with me. And well, what can I say? Okay, teacher. Okay, okay teacher. Bye. 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 Everybody. Bye. 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 Okay, see you on Monday. See you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye. Good night, teacher. Okay, good night, sir. Hold on a second. Ok, Luis Manuel Muñoz. We are going to have 10 minutes. Tendremos 10 minutos. Usted me dice si tiene alguna duda en español. Ahorita puede preguntarme lo que desee sobre cualquier tema. Alguna duda o comentario que le genere eh, este programa. Eh, más que toda esa cuestión de, lo, de, lo, de los puntos para poder llegar, teacher. Ok. Por ejemplo, no sé cómo se dice eso de los puntos cardinales de eh, Primera Calle Poniente, más que todo eso de Primera Calle Poniente, este, Esquina Opuesta, por ejemplo. Eh, cuestiones así, sí me cuesta un poco. Ah, ok, ok. ¿Qué uh, about the, the, the cardinal points? Más o menos tiene una idea de los puntos cardinales. Comenzamos. Bueno, en la escuela cuando estamos pequeñitos nos ponen así con los brazos abiertos y viendo, y viendo el sol. ¿Ya? Eh, sí. Si los ponemos así hacia el oriente viendo el sol, entonces la mano eh, izquierda sería el north. Sería north. And, and, the, north. and the, the right uh, would be the south. Esta sería el sur. South. And this, in this way is the east. And that one is going to be the West. Eso sería okay. cuatro puntos cardinales. ¿Ya? Uh -huh. Y cuando hable, por ejemplo, de la esquina opuesta que dice usted, across the, uh, across the, uh, de algo. ¿Ya? Yeah? O you can say, uh, let me see, in front of, you can use the word too. En vez de, eh, de usar la, las mismas expresiones que usamos ya en español. Hay expresiones más fáciles en inglés que podría ser a uh, in front of, en frente de. ¿Ya? Front on. Ya, yeah, in front of. En este caso eh, sería, por, por ejemplo, first street eh, y poniente. Uh, and for example, and the fair If you are talking about the first street on west. On west. Ese yeah. sería el poniente. Yeah, west. Ese sería el poniente. Ajá. Oh. Uh -huh. Porque como aquí las direcciones son raras, dice cuarta calle poniente. Ajá. Uh -huh. Y avenida, ya. Yeah. Sometimes sí. it's, it's really difficult. Sometimes. Yeah. Ajá. Ok. En ese caso, teacher, lo, lo que igual no me quedó muy claro es esta cuestión de la diferencia específica entre el go y el get. Ah, ok. Ok. Generalmente, get lo usamos para el momento cuando llegamos a algún lugar. Por ejemplo, le, yo le pregunto, ¿a qué hora llega usted a su oficina? ¿A qué hora llega usted a su oficina? O, ¿cómo puedo llegar al banco? ¿Cómo llego al banco? 
Y en cambio mm -hmm. la otra, la otra dice, go straight ahead for 10 blocks, vaya recto por 10 cuadras. Eso ya sería un movimiento completo. Y en cambio mm -hmm. el, el get sería de llegada. Mm -hmm. Ya, yeah, I get to my home at 7, uh, somebody said, 7 p.m. Mm -hmm. Esa sería la diferencia. Ah, ok, 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 sí, ahora lo entiendo, lo entiendo, entonces. Ok, ok. ¿Qué otra cosa no comprende? Eh, eh, básicamente, esa, de los temas que hemos estado abordando, básicamente eso, Tiche. Ok, excelente. ¿Y cómo vamos con las tareas? ¿Las lleva al día? No, teacher, sinceramente espero mañana avanzar. Ah, ok, sí. Ah, sí, casi no me ha quedado chance, pero espero en la mañana avanzar. Ah, ok, el, el examen final, teacher, el lunes lo haríamos o, hasta me, o mañana. Mm, no, yo, yo creo que sería después del de, de lunes. No sé la fecha cómo aparece ahí en la plataforma. Pero ah, si okay. dice final exam is going to be after the last class. Ajá, ajá. Ok. Ok, excelente. Bye. Ya en la mañana me voy a poner al día, teacher. Ok, ok. Excelente. Ajá. No more questions. No, teacher. Ah, ok, excelente. Agradezco, okay, su, agradezco su tiempo. I hope to see you on Monday and that you can continue in the next uh, module, ok? Ok, thank you, teacher. Oh, ok, bye bye. Thank you very much. See you on Monday.